Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Chrysalis. I am Rufal, play this game for you. Woo! Who named that island? And, we're, and what were they smoking? Evil spirit island, I... Oh, hello! Hey, you caught me off guard, too. But... You're in town and afraid of monsters? Apparently. People are a little paranoid, aren't you? Oh, yeah? What happened? Oh! I suppose that explains the paranoia. What do you think? Hmm. Is his last name Kent, by any chance? No? Rats. Now oh, what's the shop have to offer us? Wow. Ah. Uh, yeah. We can get stuff here, but we will need to pay out the nose for them. Fair enough. Let's see if we can talk what the Elder has to say. Hey there. Hi, Ralph. What's up? Oh. Sacrifice if we want safety. Well, that's rude. Go from Protoa? Who? I'm kind of looking for for one of those. Somebody, tap. Thought she was headed to the to Dragonia. What, do you want to sacrifice your Uncle Clark instead? That's it, I've had enough of this. All we had to do to, to, to get rid of the plot wall was actually you step into town long enough to, for it to show up on our return list. Out of the way, punk. Phil Tanks are going to do something about Evil Spirit Island. And it should be noted, we are going to need to be level 11 in order to actually finish that place off. So, don't skimp on the monster killing. Aha! Ow! Ah! Let's turn that off. Thanks, Dolphin! Turn that off and commence with, with some actual killing. Aha! Well, the fire sword's great for dealing with the flyers, and it's the only thing that works on these mushrooms. It's not the ideal weapon. We need the water sword to make bridges and to deal with salamanders, and we need the the wind sword to break down stone walls because the wind is great at that. Don't question it, we've seen it several times. Aha! The salamanders also shoot paralysis, which is what made grinding for the sacred shield worthwhile. That's one of those stone walls. Aha! Yay! Oh, right. Take that, punk! Bother me no more! Ow! Never fails, kill one, another one comes up. Oh well, find us some stairs and... Start making progress. These will do! No, 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 go up the stairs. Aha! Salamanders! Take that! Alright, onward, for loot! Today's 
Today's loot is brought to you by water. Aha! We get the iron necklace. Works exactly like the shield ring, except for our physical defense. Making it, thus making it a lot. And for the sake of some money and a sizable chunk of experience, hello, sir! Mavics are worth, are worth over 120. about you. Let's explore this other path. Strictly because it's longer and will let us get more experience. Ow. Let's eat this fruit. Those flying things and the and the salamanders don't appear to be poisonous. The mushrooms downstairs are poisonous, though. All right, now for the moving platforms. You do have to be careful with these because anytime you take a hit on a moving platform, you fall through it. Jerk! Take that! I have fury! A bad habit of pushing the wrong direction after, a st after getting off the stairway. I'll find a way to use these against you people. Ah, punk. Who else wants some? You want some. Take that. Ah. And we've reached the town. Hooray! Seems like a graveyard. This is not encouraging. I guess I did say people were disappearing. Hello, sir. Ah, hey, clerk. Yeah, it looks like a mess. Oh! So it's the sorcerer from Dragonia. Severa, huh? Right. Thanks for the info. Well, Severa, we do need to be level 11 before we can face her. And these zombies are of no threat to us. No, seriously, they don't attack us. We can't attack them. Unfortunately, all we have to get to get experience on in here are the soldiers from from Mount Saber. And the flying monkeys. The little pet won't save you. Where are you? Take that. The monkeys are worth quite a bit more than the than the soldiers. So maybe we'll just stick to beating them up. Hopefully. There doesn't seem to actually be a way to hurt those shadows. 
They're very irritating, because they can hurt you. How much was that butterfly worth? A lot! Good to know. Move platform! What do I got? Ooh, more fresh fruit! Alright. We have everything of note, so let's just try and get to where we need to go without getting killed. Hello, sir! Wow, that works well! I always try taking him on with the wind sword, it takes significantly longer. <laughs> eat some more fresh fruit and be on our way. Alright, but up to up to north is a dead end, so we wanna come down this way. Ow. Leave me alone, jerks. In case that butterfly cunt gets any ideas. Oh! I got shadowed. Fine, I won't go after the medical herb that's over there. Be that way, you can keep it. Let's go over this way and beat up Sabera. Speaking of... To that, we'll want, we need the flame sword, and of course, to be level 11. The shield ring will serve us a lot better than the iron necklace. But she uses a lot of projectiles. Look, it's Messia! Or is it? Yeah, since you can't, since you can't normally stab people, clearly this isn't this isn't Messia. Hello, Sabera! We're the fight is for, and she welcomes us to our doom! Have some flames! Uh, come back on screen. And die! Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, she still has Messiah! Get back here! Bother. What's this? Wow. Oh, how useful. Bother. Yeah, the broken statue's not very useful. There's some very handy cracks going down the middle of it, too. Right. Well, let's go back to town. Do this convenient shortcut. But having beaten up Sabera has turned all the villagers first back into villagers instead of zombies. And they are oh so grateful. Altar for the statue of gold is close to this island. The statue of gold? Well, whether we like it or not, this busted statue is it. <laughs> so we're gonna need to find a way to fix it. Um, thanks? So, can you help me get across the whirlpools? If you take the Statue of Gold and place it properly, you can return safely from any store. Right. That doesn't change the fact we need to fix the thing. What do you think, kid? Oh, find the glowing lamp. It's apparently in the lighthouse. I can fix anything. Clark! Lighthouse is on Joel Island! How do we get there? Um... Thanks? Right. Oh, well, believe it or not, the, uh, high glasses are what we need. So, Clark is actually extremely helpful.
And the people around here aren't scared anymore, either. Hooray! Yeah, you go fishing. Yeah, Clark was safe. He really was, Mr. Kent. Yeah, me too. <laughs> oh well. What do we do with these glasses, you may be wondering. Well, first, we should put them on. And, come in here! But there's nothing! Or is there? And we reach the lighthouse! Hey, you! Did you find what you're looking for? Hey, wake up! You know what? I have a solution for this! <laughs> wake up, you! Yeah, I noticed, but I wanted to talk to you! Well, fine, be that way! I don't know. Woo! Loot! Hooray! Now we use the... We use the lamp! And suddenly the statue is all better again. Hooray! Gotta go use it. Help me, Mr. Dolphin! You're one of the few people around here I like! Take that, punk! And you! Aha! This island here is the one referenced. Put the statue! And place it! And the angry sea is calm. Meaning, of course, this whirlpool isn't here anymore. It's the only whirlpool that went away. But, wise man makes good on her promise to teach us barrier. And she and the rest are going to leave for, for Chiron in, my, in Mount Hydra. Oh good, maybe someone who can give me information. Yeah, yeah, she did something silly. Alright, I'll see you there. Can we get one of the more overpowered spells in the game? Barrier, which will block pretty much any projectile. But, this leads to town, and, and from town, we shall pick up next time. We'll see you then. Later.